Wait for it. Wait. It's coming. We're going to go for a little run around on the Alps. Mrs. Bonneville is behind that fence having a sunbathe. <sighs> Should we get out of here? Oh, roll the intro. <laughs> roll the intro on my own in the Alps. Goodbye. This is one of us playing Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. We'll go this way, shall we, guys? Let's go and have a little play. Let's go and have a little play. So, yeah, this is the outskirts of Sol. Beautiful. Can't recommend it enough, guys. If you were... Uh, if you are considering coming down to um, the Alps, use this as your base. Um, I'm going to just go explore, just as we do. Just as we do. Da -da -da, let's go down here, eh? I say I have absolutely no idea where we're going. But um, we've had, so far, 10 days or so. I think it's fair to say on this particular trip, the weather has been mixed. But generally speaking, it's not stopped us doing anything that, uh, we, wanted to, that we wanted to do, sorry. Some of the vlogs that you've already seen, if you have stuck around and watched them, are uh, exclusively us off. Um, the GSA, and that, to be perfectly honest, it was um, very much planned and intended, because um, wanted to uh, just have a relaxing trip down to the Alps for this one. Really did. I'm self-employed, and work has been full on, which I'm not complaining about. But just wanted a little bit of a relaxing holiday, and that's what we're certainly having so far. When you are seeing this, we've got four, four full days left in the Alps, and then we're going to be riding from Kits, uh, sorry, not Kitzbühel, Sol, up to Strasbourg. We've booked two nights in a hotel in Strasbourg. We really love Strasbourg, guys. So we're going to have a little explore there. But hey, look at me wishing on. In front of you is the Ville de Kieser. Fantastic. I'll tell you what we're going to do, guys. We're going to try and ride up there. Or get a bit closer anyway. What do you think? Let's go up here. Let's go. Oh no. Yeah. Let yeah. Let's go up to Chefau and have a little look. Let's go and have a little look. See if we can get a bit closer to these bad boys. Thank you, fella. Oh look at that. Oh god. You know I like me balconies. I up. Got some bikers out. Right, let's see if we can get a bit further up there. So where you are now is a little place called Chefau. We actually rode our um, E mountain bikes here a couple of days ago. <laughs> that was a great day. I'll link that here. And we stopped in this little restaurant, pub, whatever it is, right in front of you. Fabulous. Yeah, this is Chefau, guys. Tiny, tiny little place, but lovely. Absolutely lovely, and, and I've got no, absolutely no idea where I'm going. Just going to keep riding up. That's the objective on this little ride out. Ride up. Oh, we're being turned around here. Don't know what's going on, guys. Just lift my visor. Yeah, we are being turned around, guys. I'm not sure what is going on there. So, let's go back down. May, may have been an accident, guys. Not sure. Right, let me pick back up when I can uh, pick, up, pick up a road that takes us up to that bad boy up there. 
back into Sheffield. I think if I go down to the bottom of the road, pick up the main valley road, as I call it. So you've got a number of um, villages and towns that lay um, kind of nestled beneath the uh, the Ville de Kiza. You've got Sol, this place, Sheffau. You've got a place called Almau, uh, Going, a few others. Cute. Nice guy. I think I can go down this way. Wild. I'm going to Wild, guys. <laughs> we did say this was going to be a little bit of a magical mystery tour. So, oh. Wild. I'm not sure whether... Wild. Nice. Again, as you can... Oh, God. I don't know whether I could go up here, but... Hey, I'm on a GSA. Ah, okay. Oh, God. That was a really tight bend, guys. Did you see that? Wow, 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 wow. I think this is probably a dead end. Hello, little donkey. Oh, dear, I don't want to scare you, fella. I don't want to scare... Oh, God, it is a dead end. I'll have to turn around. Is it a dead end? <laughs> I'm going. Uh, hello, ER. It's got to open my visor, guys. Sorry. Oh, hello. Uh, hello, Mr. Doggy Woggy. Hello. <sighs> yeah, turned around. <laughs> yeah, as you can see, this is a dead end in Austria. Hello, fella. There you go. Anyway, I just wanted to show you what a typical farm in Austria looks like. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, I'm going to scare this donkey again now. Should I turn my engine off? I won't rev it. If you pick back up <laughs> at the bottom of that road that I shouldn't have obviously ridden up. Actually, I've just seen the sign that clearly states it was a dead end. Um, now then, I think, yeah, let's get back on the... Uh, Let's get back on the main road, hang a left, and see if we can... Uh, I just want to get up to, this, to the top, or not the top. I want to get a little bit closer to this mountain range here called the Ville de Kiza. Oh, I'm going. Trapped her. Goodbye. I'm off. Oh, actually, I'm going to get myself a little drink from Spa. I'm going to go and get myself a brew, a cold drink from the Spa in El Mau. We like us. Oh, look at this. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. <sighs> Not quite ready for one of them yet, but very nice. Nonetheless, very, very nice indeed. Very nice. That's not a bad view, is it, guys? That is not a bad view. All right, guys, welcome back. As you can just see, I've had a, a smoothie and some pepperoni sausage. Right, let's go and have a little look. See if we can get up this, or a little bit closer to this mountain range. Right, I am doing a right. I'm doing one. Kaiser bad. I don't know. I don't know where I am. Right, we're obviously leaving El Mau. Again, look at the cycle paths. I've never been. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Nor's Mrs. Bonneville. Oh, golfists. Crazy golf first time today. You need to look at that. I'm not a golfist, and I certainly never used to be a a supporter of mountain bikes and cycling in general, but since we hired the e-bikes the other day, wow, I would buy two e-bikes in a heartbeat, but unfortunately in the UK, we haven't got, we just haven't got the infrastructure. We certainly haven't got stuff like this, look. This is a magical mystery tour, isn't it? Just want to get closer to these things, look. Look at that. I want to touch them. Wow. 
Any of these will do me. And Mrs. Bonneville. Any of these, please. Any of these, thank you. I'm not complaining. I wouldn't be complaining. Because these are wonderful. Look at this in front here. That's got my name written all over it, hasn't it? Come on. You know it has. Look at that. Fabulous. Oh, it's a dead end. <laughs> oh, I've done it again. Oh, dear me. I'm going to have to turn around. Apologies. Okay. We have successfully navigated and got ourselves out of who wants to be a millionaire row. Sorry, billionaire row. And, um, yeah, I've had a little slight change of plan, guys. I'm going to... So instead of doing a left down of the down at the bottom of the valley to Kitzbühel, I'm going to do a right and head back towards Sol. But I'm going to go up a little road that we've walked up a couple of times to see if I can show you a different view of Sol. So I'm now heading towards the uh, direction of Innsbruck and Kufstein. Kufstein's beautiful, well worth a visit, particularly the castle. We've done a little vlog on that. And equally, Innsbruck for, oh, wow, a whole host of different reasons. Fabulous. Innsbruck's beautiful. I think it's kind of the unofficial or the official capital of the Austrian Tyrol, I think. Don't quote me on that, guys. Anyway, Innsbruck's stunning. We did the, uh, I'll link it somewhere, we did the Imperial Palace and a few other uh, visitor attractions. Really, really enjoyed myself in uh, Innsbruck. Cracking day out. I know Mrs. Bonneville did as well. Right, let's go and have a little look. It's about five, ten miles down here, guys, so I'll pick back up with you when I'm a little bit closer to where I want to go. Right, so back into Salt. Let's have a little look. Let's have a little look. Sorry, guys, I'm going to just open the visor again for a little bit. Right. In we come. Into Salt. Now, then I need to be the other side of the roundabout. Bear with me, ladies and gentlemen, this may go wrong. Wouldn't surprise me. Now then, now then, now then, I need to be... Sorry about all the shaky footage. I need to be over there. Ah, yes. We know where we are, guys. Welcome back. So... This is, uh, I say, this is a, a walk we have done a couple of times. Um, obviously, a little bit further up uh, the valley here. This is um, the reason why this car park, or these car parks, get so busy. But again, plenty of places to park. Oh, and guess what? You don't have to pay. So I'm rapidly, rapidly considering handing in my passport. Yeah, um, and then you park your car up and you walk, what, four or five hundred metres, a little bit further. Um, past some wonderful properties. I'm not going to go on about the balconies because I'm boring myself. Past a pub here on the right, which is amazing inside. Truly amazing. The Saxon Harm or something. Past the Sex Hotel, the Saxon Harm Hotel. <laughs> I've probably pronounced all of that wrong. Sex and blick. And then um, the uh, the gondola, the ski lift. And there it is in front of us, look. Uh, we've done this a couple of times. First time we did it, we just went to the first station on the ski lifts. This here. Uh, walked back down, took us about two and a half hours, and then a couple of days ago we went right up to the top station. <sighs> Indicators. 
Yeah, went right up to the top station and uh, walked down, and it took us hours. <laughs> it took us about four hours, four and a half, five hours. It's nearly eight miles. Wonderful. Wonderful. Right, let's see. Uh, let's see how far we can get up this road. Uh, up we go. Up we go. This is going to be character building, we think. It's nice, thank you. Cheers, fellas. Obviously in the sports cars. Up we go, up we go, up we go. Oh, this is wonderful. This is one. Oh, look, guys. In a minute, I'm going to get off the bike and show you the views. But uh, not right now. I'm going to concentrate on uh, keeping this bad boy shiny side up. You have to have your wits about you. Couple there enjoying uh, a snack. This. <laughs> oh, in a minute. In a minute, I think I'm going to be treated to an amazing view. But this is just lovely. Different perspective on a bike. Absolutely wonderful on a bike. Wow, wow, wow. In a minute, I'm going to just flip it around and ride back down and show you the view. Because I couldn't show you before. But I'm going to... Actually, just remember, Mr. Vonnable, we ride on the right here. We ride on the right. Yeah. I'm going to uh, flip the bike around now and just show you uh, what is what. Look at that. Isn't that wonderful? Come on. Come on now. Get on the internet. Get on Google. Get your maps out. Polish your bike down. Give your wife, your loved one, a little nudge and say, come on, love. We're going to the Alps. Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? I'm going to see if we can find a little place to pull in and uh, soak up this fantastic view. It's, oh, what a view. Oh, wow. If I can get the bike, can I get the bike next to that bench? Oh, if so, look. Look at what I'm going to be sat looking at. Do you know what? I think I can. I think I can, dear YouTuber. Sod it. It'll have to be. Because that's where it's staying. Oh, dear. Oh, it's a big old boy in it. Hey. Yeah, that's all right. Mrs. Bonneville wouldn't like that. <laughs> but look at that view. Look at that view. That. Down there, guys, is Sol, the church. Uh, somewhere to the left of it is our hotel. That's a Volkswagen van, caddy. That's a BMW 1200 GSA. Up an Alp. <laughs> Up an Alp. That's a tight one. That is a tight one, guys, I must admit. Ooh, character building. Let's get off this mountain. Mrs. Bonneville will shout at me when she sees this. No, she won't. She'll be like, why couldn't I come? Well, she was sunbathing. 